name is Lillian Dack. I'm a freshman at Anna Marie College, and I'm from Athol, Mass. Corona affects both sides of my family. A lot of people have underlying conditions in my family. My mom, for example, has a history of colorectal cancer. She had it twice. Both times, she was treated with chemo and radiation and had tumors removed. Because of her history with cancer and because of some other underlying conditions that she has, she is more at risk to get coronavirus. My mother is unfortunately considered a an essential worker for the government. She works at a government facility that normally would build parts for weapons or computers or, in one case, space-related things. She works there as a planner scheduler, um, so she deals with customers and engineers deciding which parts are of the top priority to be built and shipped. Normally, She doesn't have to wear a mask or gloves all the time unless she's going to a specific part of the facility, but now they're taking that precaution because of the corona. Um, She works from home when she can, so usually twice a week. Her boss and her family both are very concerned because of the underlying condition about her having to work. Their desks, thankfully, are six feet apart as it is, so she's not coming into contact with too many people. Earlier in the year, though, They had everyone take everything on their desks home because a person there had come in contact with someone who had coronavirus and they didn't want to take the risk of someone getting sick. So they had to sanitize the entire building from ceiling to floor just in case something happened. I understand that people are probably very bored and want to leave their houses and quarantine has been going on for a very long time, but I... I don't think we should be leaving our houses to just go hang out in stores or in public. We need to be careful. I know that people need to get back to their jobs because they need the money. But I think we also need to be really careful about which places reopen and how we go about doing that and how we go about opening the businesses because it would just make people more at risk. I think the best thing we can do right now to stop the spread of coronavirus is adhere to the quarantine stay home as much as possible, social distance when outside, and wear masks. Hopefully, we can soon end the virus and the quarantine.